Now we have our fourth category in the 2022 Monster Hobbies Build a Monster Contest. This is MONMH4 Monster Figure Dioramas. And we have three contestants in this category, but with four models entered. We have Ed Rodriguez, Kendall Conniff, and Mark McGovern. So let's check out their models, and then I will tell you who the winner is. The first entry is for MONMH4 Monster Figure Diorama. This is Polar Light's King Kong. Ed says, I extended the base to make it bigger. I also added a tree, which is from the Aurora Batman kit and Anne Darrow. Also added various jungle foliage and a custom backdrop. Painted with Delta Cermacote acrylic paint. Ed has another entry in MONMH4, Monster Figure Dioramas. This is the Monsters in Motion Wax Encounter House of Wax model. Ed added some height to the back of the base to get the wax sprayer higher over the Phyllis Kirk figure. Also added some flickering lights in the flame area. Painted with Delta Ceramicote acrylic paint. Kendall's second entry is in MON MH4 Monster Figure Dioramas. This is Mobius Grim Reaper with scratch built base. Modifications to the figure include hood extended with Aves, texture added to cloak, left arm repositioned up and forward, hand changed to be holding the hourglass, hourglass position changed from his belt to his hand, hourglass has had the locator pins removed, the inside polished, sand added and the ends changed. Mods to the Psy include wood grain added to handle, metal bands added to the handles, and new blade created. Base, stone, arch, and door is styrofoam. Door detail is cardboard and aves. Fence posts are styrofoam. Fence is wire, styrene, wood dowels, and aves. The torch sta statues are gaming minis, as are the statues in the doorway. LEDs and hot glue added for the flames. Trees made from uh, wire, covered in hot glue, bark carved with a soldering iron, and then painted. The cobblestone walkway is carved in styrofoam. The ground cover is dirt and gravel with several applications of static grass. The vines are dried roots from my garden. Ravens are 3D printed. Mark's next entry is in MONMH4 Monster Figure Diorama, The Badlands. I won the resin base in a raffle held on the What A Fest website during the COVID pandemic. It was designed to fit several critters from the Aurora Polar Lights customizing monster kits. I customized it some more by converting the kits African Vulture and Mad Dog into an American Turkey Vulture and a Coyote. They're fighting over a dead black-footed ferret, originally a rat, oblivious to the scattered human remains in the scene. Now wasn't that some amazing work? All right, let's find out who is in gold, who's got silver, who's got bronze, and who's got the honorable mention among our contestants. So once again, Floyd, hand me that letter. <clears throat> Woo, hand me the letter, Floyd. All right, Floyd, thank you once again for the envelope. And now let's take a look at who our winners are. Ooh, the suspense. All right, for gold, we have the Grim Reaper by Kendall Conniff. In silver, we have House of Wax by Ed Rodriguez. Really nice colors in there. In bronze, we have The Badlands by Mark McGovern. And for honorable mention, once again, King Kong by Ed Rodriguez. 
So I hope you enjoyed those entries into the MON MH4 Monster Figure Diorama. And now we're going to get into our next category, which skips ahead a bit. It is MON MH7. So you can check it out by clicking on this video right here.